Hey guys, Justin back for another pack a day video. Today is October 13th, Friday the 13th. Today is my 74th day of opening packs of cards. Yesterday my video went on a little long, so we're going to get right into it. For series one, we're looking for Jake Cronenworth and Pavin Smith to complete the question, uh, the collection. We're also looking for numbered cards, parallels, inserts, etc. We got a little something back there, looking like it's going to be a World Baseball Classic, maybe. I don't know. Interesting. All right, we got a Scherzer, Cal Mitchell, Tariq Skubal, Michael Givens, Kevin Sheets. We got a combo card, another combo card. Duran, oh, it's a blue. Oh, yeah, I forgot this was a uh, blaster box. Forgot we can get blues. Who is this? Seth Lugo on the blue. Followed by a Wander Franco, Stars of the MLB. And a Matt Strom, Tommy Edmond, Brett Beatty, rookie card, and... Lucas Giolito, so did not find Pavin Smith or Jake Cronenworth again. It's so funny. I mean, I, I enjoy the chase of completing the collection um, a little bit, but maybe not as much as I <laughs> is that as much as I've been having to chase it. You know. Let's talk uh, Atlanta Phillies last night. Congrats to the Philadelphia Phillies for making it to the NLCS. They beat Atlanta last night one to three. Trey Turner, the absolute madman, goes four for four with one home run. And then Nick Castellanos goes three for three with two home runs. Castellanos sets an MLB record for two two home run games back to back in the postseason. First person to ever do it. I think he said first person. Or not he, but they. I think they said first person to ever do it. I wasn't maybe it was just the first Philly. I don't know. Anyways, I've always been a fan of Nick Castellanos. It's really sad that the Reds couldn't keep him around, but he didn't even get to play his first playoff game until his ninth year in the in the league. So, um, congrats to him! Big accomplishment, and um, it'll be a good one. It, they're going to have home field advantage versus Arizona. Um, I'm still rooting for Arizona, but it's almost hard to root against Philly when they've got a team like this. So, we'll see. The ALCS and the NLCS are both set now. Four teams remain: Texas Rangers versus the Houston Astros. That's going to be at Houston, and then Arizona at the Phillies. Game start Sunday, so we'll be excited. I'll have to figure out what to do this weekend until then. All right, let's get into the Series 2 pack. We got a Matt Olson, Luis Servino, uh, Dre Jameson, Zach Gallen, Adam Adovino. We got an Andrew Vaughn, a D-backs combo card, an Austin Nola, and we got a backwards card here. It's a Corbin Carroll, and it's going to be a rainbow foil. That is not too shabby. I will absolutely take that. Corbin Carroll is the best thing you can possibly find in a Series 2 as far as I'm concerned. And we also have a Cody Bellinger on the Tops 1988. I don't know if I have that one yet or not. Um, but I am working on that set. Then an Alec Manoa. What do we got here? Hunter Dozier. There's a Jonathan India. I do like India. And there's Chris Taylor kicking things or ending the pack there for Series 2. Really happy to pull that uh, Corbin Carroll. Um, I do not have a rainbow foil yet of him and i think he's just gonna continue i mean i it's impossible to tell the future obviously but he, if he's playing this well in the postseason this young i mean it's he's he's just doing great man these update packs are hard to open okay this is an update pack we just added this to the daily um pack a day video here we've got a and i'm i'm, I'm already like 212, I think, out of the 330 checklist. So, um, we've got a Connor Wong here, Brenton Doyle, two of the game's best chats, Mike Trout, Julio Rodriguez. That's a really awesome combo card. I'd love to get that in a parallel. We got a uh, Hamar Candelario. I don't know if you had to say, say his name or not. Um, sorry, I'm just moving some stuff around here. Man, every time, so many Nationals players have their City Connect jerseys in their cards, and honestly, it's just awesome. Here's a Jose Hernandez rookie card. Here's a Bryce Miller rookie debut, Romy Gonzalez, Mikel Garcia rookie card, and we have a gold right here, a CNO Perez for the Baltimore Birds. I'll throw him up there. Got a, a little little mini rainbow or something going on up here today, and that's pretty much going to be it for the pack. Kevin Kiermaier, Mason Ingler, and Joey Weimer rookie debut rounding out the pack. We still have our tops chrome. As the season winds down, there's four remaining. Ronald Acuna Jr. couldn't get it done. 
for the Braves in the postseason, but I still think he's going to take the MVP. I have some buyback cards of Ronald Acuna Jr. Let's see if we can find any more. Um, Ozzy Albies last night, him and Acuna Jr. both go 0 for 4, actually. We've got a Jose Ramirez on the tops, 1988. We definitely have a couple of those. Here's a Tyler Stevenson and a U Darvish. Nothing fantastic out of that Chrome pack. But that's okay. We've got more Chrome. That came out of a hobby box, by the way. And then last pack of the day. We've got a Topps Cosmic Chrome 2023. There, This is one of four remaining packs. This Kyle Stowers rookie card, which is, you know, a nice numbered to 25 card. Um, you know, I'd prefer a different Baltimore rookie, probably. Um, but, obviously, no offense, Kyle Stowers. But, um, man, there's got to be another hit in here. I don't believe it. We've, we've pulled one Nucleus Refractor, and we've pulled that. We did get a Stars in the Night, but that's it. We're still looking for Stella Novas, Supernovas, Planetary Pursuits, um... This hobby box, this can't be that all that's in this hobby box, man. I mean, it'll probably end up being the very last pack. I, I we'll see, we'll see. Anyways, um, come on, man, let's get some last pack magic today. There's a Shohei Otani. I don't know if I have this card yet or not. There's a Paul Goldschmidt. Another star clusters. That's two star clusters back to back, and it doesn't look like there's going to be a hit today. This is a Corey Seager and a Josh Young. I don't know if I have this one. I am building all of the inserts, I mean, other than the Planetary Pursuit, probably, for this set. And then, last but not least, we got a Kodai Senga rookie card. There's a printing line on this one. I don't know if you guys can see that right down there. Scratch. It's pretty bad, actually. It's really noticeable right away. But, anyways, today wasn't a bad day. You know, I'm just really looking forward to being able to pull some hits out of this Cosmic Chrome. And I know everybody else is pretty much over. I know the hobby moves at a very fast pace, and people are... Or in a product, out of a product, in a product, out of a product. I pick the ones that I like. I like the I like the paper, you know. I want to complete the sets. I want to build the insert sets as well. That's why I'm doing Series 1, Series 2, and Update, even though people have very much moved on from them. I think Series 2 is probably going to be one that people keep doing for a while with Corbin Carroll and other, some of the other good rookies. I think that will probably be this year's version of uh, 2022 Update. But I also just really love uh, Cosmic Chrome. And I didn't, you know, I, I wasn't in the hobby last year when it came out in 2022, but um, I saw it this year and I immediately fell in love. But anyways, I've been yakking long enough. Thanks for watching, guys. Today was the 74th day and I'll be back tomorrow for day 75. No baseball until Sunday, but hey, we've got other sports this weekend, NBA, preseason, college football, NFL. So I'll find something to talk about while we make these videos. Thanks again for watching. Please like and subscribe if you do enjoy these videos and I'll catch you tomorrow.